Bass doesn't have a size minimum in the Minnesota fishing regulations. This is the official book that everyone gets when they buy a fishing license. This is what people should be reading. Nobody in my comments apparently know how to read this book. This is available at your local sporting goods store in Minnesota, or if you're not in Minnesota, if you want to prove me wrong, you can go on to their website and download the PDF file of the exact same booklet here, all right? The rules are in here, and it's very, very, very clear. An elementary school child can read this and understand it. So let's go to page 22 which I have memorized by now because everyone just is arguing with me. Page 22. This is inland season and limits. This is where I'm fishing. Inland. Right at the top. Species, open season, and possession limit. And then in parentheses it says size. Right? If there is a size minimum or limit, it will indicate so within the parentheses. I'm also fishing in the northeast zone. That's the open season. And oh, look at that. Six combined total largemouth bass or smallmouth bass. Does it look like there's any like parentheses or any indication of what like minimum size or anything like that on there? You guys can go and find this information so easily, but everyone seems to decide to just Google it and, and then look it up and they have confirmation bias and they get information that is incorrect. And so if you're following the laws and regulations in Minnesota based off of a Google search, you're doing it wrong. You should be reading this booklet. But let me go one step further. So right down here, you see how it says parentheses right there? And it says only one catfish over 24 inches. That's for catfish. Right? Notice how there's parentheses right there. And at the top here, like I mentioned, right, it says possession limit. So it gives you the possession limit, but then it also gives you the size in parentheses, and that's what is being indicated for the catfish. But let's go even one step further. On page 37 of the booklet, there's special regulations, and then there's experimental and special regulations down on here. So this page here includes more information on the fish like limits and stuff like that. So if there were any other limits for bass, it would be written right here, right? And there is none. So if you spoke to a DNR officer and they told you anything different from what I've told you, that DNR officer is wrong, or I can pretty much bet on my life that you didn't even talk to a DNR officer and all you did was Google this and try to claim that a DNR officer would tell you that. Yeah.